Hello everyone, welcome back. A try on haul this week with Estia. I featured Estia uh, quite a bit last summer and a little bit in the winter. I don't know if you remember that gold Lurex top that I got to wear over Christmas, which I was absolutely over the moon with. I'm, I'm going to link that top actually because it, it's a great it's a great piece to have in your wardrobe for like any any party any celebration you can wear it with a lot of different things and i've loved it um now one of the things that i said in the last haul that i liked about s deer was the cut of the clothing how it fits to your body it i it's definitely cut different to high street clothing it's more nipped in at the waist definitely so bear that in mind ladies but everything i tried on from them it just seems to accentuate the figure better um and i don't know how they do it it's like this dress that i'm wearing i raved about it in the first haul and i thought i will wear it today i'm not a lover of black but the way this dress is crafted is absolute perfection and yeah I think I've put it on today and I thought why are you not wearing this dress black is not my colour but I do really like the dress Estia needs to do this dress in other colours it's cotton so it's nice and breathable there's a lot of material in it maybe that's what accentuates the waist I don't know um, it's got lots of panelling in it, tiny, tiny pleats and panels, and I'll show you in the try-on in a minute. It's absolutely, really so well made. Um, yeah, so this is one of the favourites from last year. I need to wear it more. I think last year it was more coming up to winter. I think this dress would look great with a pair of flat sandals. I might try it with that. I think last time I dressed it up really smart with a posh belt and heels and bag. I'm going to do it more. I'm going to wear it more casual this time. Let me know your thoughts, ladies. Let me know your thoughts. And it fits a lot better because I did lose a fair bit of weight. Although I have been putting weight on, ladies, just for a little catch up there. Anyway, let's get into the film. My name's Laurie, by the way. I always leave that too late. My name's Laurie. I'm a fashion, beauty and lifestyle blogger, stroke blogger here at Vanity and Me. I'm a size 10, I would say, at the moment. A UK size 10 and I'm 5 foot 2. So, let's get into the film. I'll talk you through the sizes of the clothing as I go through the film as well. Um, if there's a discount code, I will post it up here right now and you can refer back to that and it will also be in the description box as well. I can't remember in the email if there's a special offer or not, so anyway, if there is, it's going up now. Um, let's talk about what I'm wearing. Again, it's the black dress. It's a shirt dress, buttoned all the way through. It's got long puff sleeves, this dress, but I much prefer them ruched up now this is another thing this is one of the things i'm talking about this sdia now look at the blousy bit at the bottom but look how much tighter it is cut at the top and this is what i'm saying about a different kind of fit they've definitely cut for a, a better silhouette and i love that um the, like I said, the dress has got tiny panels all the way through. I'm going to show you that in the try-on. I've paired it today with my belt from Bow Today. Um, it does come with a double wrap belt, but I preferred my own belt with this dress. So that's what I've put on today. I've got on new sandals from Very, but I might switch them over to a flat shoe so we can see what that looks like as well um, yeah and that's about it I'm going to use my crossbody Marc Jacobs snapshot bag 
Personally, I think it's the worst bag ever invented. You can't fit anything in it, but I do like the look of it. Uh, watch is Nord Green. Monica Veneda earrings. The dailies, I call them. Majuri dome ring. Lovely and plain. Uh, Mum's bangles. And the ring from MS blue on this blue which I'm absolutely loving. Yes, let's get into the film. This skirt, it's absolutely stunning. It's beautiful on. I tried it on as soon as I took it out of the bag. Uh, it's got pocket. You've got pockets to the side. Look at the pleating in this skirt. You've got big, thick pleats and that lovely beautiful print it's not all dark you've got quite a lot of light in there it there's a royal blue in there somewhere i don't know if you can see it yeah you've got little dashes of this royal blue um now i've got a navy jacket as you've all seen before and i'd like to wear this to the wedding with the navy jacket and that's how i'm going to style it today now, I only have t-shirts here. I've got a cream t-shirt and I've got a navy t-shirt. So I'm going to try on with either and see what looks best, but I think a nice uh, silky camisole under the jacket would be absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I just love that shot of blue. I don't know if you can see it. You've got the navy here and then you've got this other blue color. It's absolutely stunning. You've got an elasticated back on this one. I'm pretty sure I got this. I got this in a size medium as well. So, yeah, but what a beautiful piece of clothing. I've got the t-shirt on here. And I think that's going to pair that sort of colour. But maybe in a silk camisole. And then with the navy jacket over the top, it's going to look lovely. And yeah, I've been wondering, I've been wondering what to wear to this wedding, and it just came through the post. I, I think it's absolutely beautiful, and a little bit different, ladies, as well. Now next I've got this dress, which again, it's stunning. A, a lovely piece, cut again, like I said, now you've got a panel here. Now that's going nipped in. It's slightly rounded. I don't know if you can see that, where it's slightly rounded. And this is what I'm saying about accentuating your figure. This has got a little tie belt, side zip, for ease of getting into. It's got a little ruffle detail to the front. I don't know if I can see if there's like a extra piece at the front. Same again at the back, coming in to accentuate that waist. Little do up button there. Now, I love it. I love the color. I'm just not sure about these sleeves. They're just a little bit poofy for 61 year old me. Great on a 40 year old or a 50 year old, but 60, 60 year old me, I am just not sure. And what I'm thinking of doing, I nearly did it before I filmed, but I thought the brand won't be very pleased with that. Now under here is the green inner of the sleeve. And I'm thinking about cutting this piece off and just having the green sleeve. Then I will be absolutely over the moon with it. Let me know your thoughts, ladies. I think it's it's really lovely and swishy, light as a feather. It's lined in this like mint green. Don't know if that's showing up very well. Yeah, yeah, it's like this mint green colour absolutely beautiful and I would wear that a lot I think it's not overly dressy put a pair of flat sandals on with this to casual it down a bit 
it's a nice piece. Next I've got a skirt also in a mint green. Now I've tried so many of this type of slip skirt and I hate how they bulk at the waist, they bulk at the hips. I have three satin type slip skirts and I've never worn one of them. I've always been in the hope for one and I think this is it ladies because this fits to perfection. I don't know how they've done it. It's something to do with this cut at the waist plus this has got a zip as well. You've got a side zip in this one. Uh, an elasticated waist here but you've also got a zip as well so yeah and it there's no bulky bulky gathering I don't know if any of you have bought these slip skirts and you find that you just get ruching at the seams or the fit the shape just isn't right and I think this is perfection I'm really really pleased with this one I think this is going to look great with t-shirts and sandals I've picked out this white wrap shirt. This isn't from Estee, it's one of my own, but I think it's gonna make a beautiful pairing. Yeah, T-shirts, any shirt. I, th I think it's an easy piece to wear. I've also pulled out the white shirt from the haul last year in late in the summer because I wore this a lot at the end of summer and then winter come and it got forgotten but I remembered it and I thought I know it's still available this shirt so I wanted to give it a mention because it's such an easy comfortable piece to wear you, this has got weird sleeves you've got like a pleat in the cuff they're elasticated here and then you've got another pleat underneath. It's beautiful on and it's in like a seersucker white material. Pleat to the back, it's not fitted, not fitted at all. But it is a beautiful shirt, very, very comfortable. And I just wanted to give that an extra mention. So I might try that on with some other pieces as well. Right, next I've got this top. Now this is a bit different. Um, it's your t-shirt style top in cream. I think this is satin. I don't think it's silk. It's machine. It's machine washable. I will leave the material composition alongside it in the description, ladies. A bit of a back wing sleeve on this one. I thought it was a little bit different. I've not tried this on yet, so it's going to be interesting. I'm just not sure about it. But yeah, love that cream satin. But at the back, it's t-shirt. I don't know why they've done that. Because when I ordered, I thought it was all satin. But yeah, half satin front and half t-shirt at the back. But it is a nice piece. We'll see what it's like. I'm going to pair that with navy trousers, by the way. I, you know, these cream tops, they're a good staple item, aren't they, to have in your wardrobe. It will pair with anything, camel trousers, jeans, cream jeans, black jeans, anything black, black trousers, navy, cream, goes with everything. This was a wild card for me. I liked the neckline, the square neckline on this t-shirt. I thought, yeah, I'm going to try that for something a little bit different. I like the length of the sleeve. It's short sleeve. It covers my horrible bits of my arms, so I'm really pleased with it. I love the colour. I think this is going to look great with uh, cream or dark denim or even rust and navy. 
I thought it was just really nice. I liked the neckline, like I said, a little bit different. It's ribbed. I don't know if you can see that. It's like a ribbed material. Just a very easy piece. I've got my stone trousers out here. I think this is going to be a great pairing. I thought I'd get these out because they go with everything. This is my least favourite item. I love it and I don't love it. I think the material, the print is really beautiful. Very Parisian, I think. Very boho. I like the detail to the front with this. Um, it's like a overlock stitching. It's got a frill. There's no, no buttons. This is purely a pull over your head job with the uh, V at the front and that's got the overlocking on as well. Um, it's the sleeves that have upset me because they're too long for me. Maybe, maybe I can have them turned up then it'll be fine. But again, same as the black dress, look how thin they are at the top of the arm. They really do, everything's a lot more snug fit. And these have got a bell sleeve at the bottom. Now what I'm going to do with these most probably is put a hair tie on my wrist and then I'll, I'll just ruche them up and you'll see what that's like. I'll show you with and without because not everyone's got arms as short as me. It is a nice top. Very plain. It's just the sleeves for me are gonna be a bit of a bugbear. Um, I've got out green shorts to pair that with. I think this top needs something a little bit casual to go with it and that's what I've done. I'll most probably put um, maybe a cami or a nude bra under this because as you can see it's quite, quite see-through. Right, last item, this dress. It's a brilliant design, this dress. It also comes in stone, and I think it's like a creamy color, rather than the gray and the black pairing. It was a stone and a beige. Oh, it wasn't white, it was like a cream. And that's the color that I wanted, but I've made a wrong choice ordering online here, ladies, and I've accidentally asked for the gray and the black, which, as I've said, and not really my colours but the design of this dress is absolutely excellent and I would so love that other colour because I would wear this a lot you've got a sleeveless under here and then that has been attached and you've got like two different colours you've got a piece here to accentuate the waist and then that goes all the way down either side so that's the back you need to see it on to actually see what I'm talking about very very unusual a beautifully designed dress just not in my color I wished it was the color that I asked for but hey ho it's my fault that's not theirs yeah anyway that's it ladies so let me know what your favourite item is out of that little hole there. There's some nice pieces and like I say I love how it fits. Quality is good, the quality is very good as well. Um, if you enjoyed the film please give a thumbs up ladies, it makes such a big difference to my channel. It helps my channel to grow and I'm enjoying, you know, I'm getting on the way to 8,000 now so I just need to grow that little bit more ladies if you can give me a thumbs up I would really appreciate it and also I love to hear from you office of course um, like I said let me know what your favourite item is out of this lot yes yeah some nice pieces anyway love to you all I'll see you in the next one